Hi there, I'm Andrew. Welcome to Urban Rider for another look at some of the world's finest riding gear. Today we're going to be showing you the Bellstaff Brooklands Pro. This is one of the new items for the brand new lineup for Bellstaff Spring Summer 2019 collection. All of the new items coming in on this collection are now CE approved. So whilst we have a number of completely new items for this year, which you can check out on the brand page over at urbanrider.co.uk and in our other video reviews, of course, we have a number of revisions and updates to the best-selling key standout items in the range. The Bellstaff Brooklands is really one of the iconic jackets in the motorcycle clothing world. This has been around since the mid 60s. This is based on the jacket worn by Steve McQueen in the Mojave Desert Race. And throughout the years since then, Bellstaff have made revisions to the the overall materials and the fabrics and the technical spec of the jacket but the actual standout features the look of it has remained fairly true to that original jacket and the new version that we have here is CE approved as I said so this basically means the jacket is now fully certified to the very latest standards that have come into effect from April 2019 so this is rated to level A which is the standard expected of a full-on motorcycle jacket in terms of abrasion and in terms of impact protection. So it turns out the actual wax in and of itself passes the CE regulations for abrasion but then backed up behind the wax cotton outer layer on the zone one impact areas we have the Cordura panelling which is an abrasion resistant nylon giving it masses of anti-abrasion properties in the key impact zones. So the outer of this jacket is a 10 ounce wax and this means that it's just the tiniest bit heavier but it's very very hard to notice any difference between the new and the old version and it still makes it applicable to the exact same demands of the motorcycle jacket. So this is good for basically most of the year. Being a short cut jacket it's going to be slightly less practical in really inclement weather than a slightly longer one but it has the wonderful versatility to be able to tackle the cold weather with the 150 gram removable thermal inner liner and you can take that out of course in the summer and have something that's better in the warmer weather too. So whilst it won't do the absolute hottest days as any wax jacket tends to fall slightly short it's just a little bit less breathable a little bit heavier than an outright mesh jacket would be on the most hot days of the year it's good for everything in between and in a UK climate that's really a very good option to cover most of the bases. So the outer wax is the British Millerain. It's one of the most renowned manufacturers of wax cotton in the UK. And we have this premium, lovely wax cotton tailoring through the outside. That water repellent outer stops the water from soaking the fabric, allowing it to run off. Then we have underneath that a seam sealed Myporex membrane. This is Bellstaff's in-house waterproof and breathable membrane. And this serves to keep you completely dry in the worst weather. So you've got two barriers against the water so you can rest assured the fabric itself is gonna do a very good job of keeping the elements out. You've got level 1C approved armour in the elbows and shoulders. This is D3O. This is pretty much the industry standard. It's ideal whether you're wearing it or looking at someone wearing it. It's hard to notice. It's slimline. It's supple and malleable under normal circumstances, but it locks together on impact. You also have a pocket in the back so you can upgrade for optional back protection if you wish to go down that route as well. And the jacket, other than that, features really very similar to what we've seen in the previous collections. So if you are very familiar or you already have one of those jackets, the main difference apart from the CE approval is that slight increase in the weight of the wax to make it just a little bit more durable, but also the fit has been revised just very ever so slightly. So it's maybe one inch more generous around the chest than it used to be. So the large that we have here fits me nicely and this is designed to fit a 41 and a 42 inch chest according to our size guide over at urbanrider.co.uk and in that respect it fits true to our size guide. Last year's was a 40 and a 41 so as you can see that's just one inch more generous and as you can see here with me wearing the new one it fits me nicely. There is a little bit of room and I'm wearing that jumper so on that basis a 42 chest would get in quite easily as well. So we think that that's true. We take all the jackets and we measure all the external measurements such as the pit to pit, pit to sleeve and all the other the ones people always ask us for in each and every size in the range so you can rest assured you'll be getting the correct jacket size even first time round. so it's really important if you're buying online do head over and check out the size guide the price is 525 pounds so this is the same as last year's in terms of pricing but we have the addition of the CE approval and we have these subtle revisions but the prices remain the same so that's positive and the jackets are in stock and available now we have the black here with the brown detailing to the stitching just giving it a slightly different tone from completely blacked out throughout the jacket we also have an olive color that's just landed this morning and is equally wonderful as well 
Otherwise, the features are pretty consistent with what we've been used to and have remained pretty much unchanged. The branding is a nice balance, I find, with the Bellstaff jackets. You want a little bit of branding, Bellstaff being a stronger brand as it is, it's nice to have that slight visibility. So we have the embroidered gold patch on the left sleeve, and we have Bellstaff logo engraved into the snappers as well. These are all spring-loaded, so they're really easy to access. They operate nice and easily on the go, even with gloves on. You have the two front chest pockets with the overlay flaps, and you have the slanted access waist pockets as well. You have a lower rubberized snap to prevent any chafing on the tank, and you also have this embroidered patch overlaying the buckle on the adjustable waist belt buckle system there. You have breathers under the arm and on the side. You have extra layers of the wax cotton for extra abrasion resistance with this quilting to give it that typical vintage Mojave Brooklyn's jacket look on the shoulders and elbows. You have the roll bar across the collar. You have corduroy lining to the inside of the cuffs and collars, making it comfortable so you can do it up tight as well. You've got a little nod to the British manufacturing heritage of the Bellstaff jacket with this little Union Jack underneath the left chest pocket. They do come in a wide range of sizes, going up to 5XL. It generally fits people whose chest is the largest portion of their upper body, i.e. if your belly is bigger than your chest, these jackets are not as flattering as perhaps the Trailmaster Pro would be, the longer jacket, and the other icon from the Bellstaff range. You can check that out in another video review. So we think that this is gonna be every bit as popular as the Brooklyn's always has been. The Brooklyn's Pro is new for 2019, do check it out. If you have any questions or feedback, leave that in the section below. And stay tuned for more video reviews of the world's finest running gear, which of course includes more coming from Bellstaff's 2019 range. Thank you for watching. See you again soon. Goodbye.